Hello everyone, my name is S Comic Maker and welcome to an episode of Does Is S Comic Maker Going to Make It? Slash Is When Will S Comic Maker Leave This Earthly Plane? With your host, me, S Marger Burger. As you might be able to tell <laughs> from the lack of video this past Friday, no stream, and the fact that my voice sounds like someone is shaking a fish, I got sick recently. <laughs> and it has been the worst. <laughs> I'm not going to let that stop me, but I'm currently on antibiotics and I'm working on resting as much as possible, but it has been killing me not to make something. So Monday I sat down at my desk and decided to draw, but your girl can't just simply do the team. I ended up getting way too into it. As comic maker, what did you make? I made some some sick architecture. No, cause I'm sick and it's so cool, right? But yeah, you know, I'm gonna draw things that I always draw, boys and girls. Architecture, right? Don't I always draw that? Now, you know my mind was in a weird place when I start busting out those straight lines and perspectives. <laughs> in all honesty, I'm not that good at drawing landscapes or buildings or really technical stuff, and I've been meaning to practice them for a long while, so I took my sick opportunity to just sit down and draw something. The building that you see me drawing today is called Kinkakuji, or the Golden Pavilion, which is a Zen Buddhist temple in Kyoto. I'm working from a photo I took while my husband and I were in Japan. I've been wanting to draw this temple since I took this photo and what better way to practice architecture when picking something super complicated, right? Woohoo! I'm crazy! Originally, I was just gonna draw or maybe ink this piece a little bit, but in the end I just ended up whooping out the watercolors and going to town. No prep, no taping down paper. No planning, just going for it. And yeah, the paper curled up because I was stupid, but it has been forever since I spontaneously decided to just go ahead and start drawing and painting because I really wanted to just create something. Coughing and hacking and dying aside, I had a really relaxing time working on this. I also actually really liked how it turned out. There are some perspective issues and Good God, please don't compare it to the original photo. Don't look at the third floor. Don't get close. Don't zoom in. Why are you zooming? <laughs> but actually, I'm pretty proud of it, and it has definitely made me want to draw some more buildings. I find that something I lack with characters is environments, and I think if I practice and get more confident with drawing backgrounds, that I'll feel better about having characters interact with backgrounds. Little bits of growth are what I'm trying to work on here. In fact, I was really inspired by a couple books that I picked up while in Japan. I visited the Ghibli Museum while I was there and I wish I could show you guys photos, but unfortunately you aren't allowed to take any there. But my favorite part about the museum is this entire room dedicated to concept art made by the team behind the wonderful movies like Howl's Moving Castle and Spirited Away. While I was there, I picked up a book that had some behind the scenes stuff from Spirited Away, which is my favorite Ghibli movie, and ended up looking for other watercolor scenery books at the local book off stores in Japan. These books are what made me want to start trying some stuff out, so who knows? In the future, you might see more practice like this. My style doesn't quite match the look of these books, which I would love to achieve, but I tend to rely too much on photo reference and trying to make it look right that I forget to be more loose and experimentative, so maybe next time. Well, that's it for me, guys. <laughs> Hopefully I'll be 100% up and running after all this sick mess is over with, but in the event that I'm not, be sure to follow me on my social media so that you can keep up to date with my status. Links for all of that stuff are down below. Also, if you're new here, consider subscribing. Despite me being sick this past week, I post videos every Friday and livestream on the weekends. 
thank you all so much for being patient with me while I was getting better and for yelling at me to go back to bed. Your love and support means a lot. Until next time, everyone. I hope that we can draw together again soon. Bye, guys.